It's a lady in London here. Today I want to take you around Belsize Park in North London. This under the radar neighborhood is just south of Hampstead and north of Primrose Hill, but it often goes unnoticed by people who are too busy looking around Hampstead or exploring Primrose Hill or shopping at the markets in Camden. It's really worth a visit though because there's a lot of great shops, restaurants, cafes, there's pretty mews and hidden side streets, and there's just a lot to enjoy about this neighborhood. I hope you enjoy the tour. It's easy to get to Belsize Park. There's an underground station on the Northern Line right in the heart of the neighborhood, and buses come here too. The high street in Belsize Park is right outside the station. There's a lot going on here, from great shops and restaurants to all kinds of cafes. There's a branch of the beloved Daunt Books here too, so it's a great place if you love books. Belsize Park is packed with secret little muse streets too. Some of them have amazing houses and cottages, and they're all really fun to explore. Hidden away at the intersection of some side streets in Belsize Park is Belsize Village. This triangle is surrounded by lots of shops and restaurants and cafes, and it's another nice part of the neighborhood to take in. Speaking of side streets, there are a lot of beautiful ones in Belsize Park. You can't really go wrong here walking down random streets and just seeing what you find. There's lots of pretty houses in the area. As with many places in London, Belsize Park has great details. From vintage cars to red phone boxes, there's lots of little things to catch the eye here. It's fun to walk around the streets and take it all in. I hope you've had fun exploring Belsize Park with me, and I hope you get a chance to see it in person yourself someday too. As always, there's more on my blog, aladyinlondon.com, and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel before you go. Happy exploring.